Meanwhile, the North Korean leader Kim Jong-un watched a giant ceremony marking the completion of the new apartment blocks in Pyongyang on Tuesday. A video from the North Korean television showed Kim cutting a big ribbon and waving to crowds as fireworks went off and planes made a fly past above the show. According to the state media, KCNA, 10,000 new apartments have been added to the new district called Hwasong on the outskirts of Pyongyang. Now this it's, it's part of the project to build a total of 50,000 new homes in the capital by 2025. North Korea has regularly staged massive construction projects to extend and redevelop Pyongyang. Soldiers, students and regular citizens often make up the workforce for these projects. Now, Pyongyang is a showpiece city and recently Kim acknowledged the gulf that separates the capital from the much less developed rest of the country. North Korea officially assigns apartments to people and doesn't allow people to buy, sell and move their homes in the same way as in other countries around the world. But in recent years, unofficial and unverified accounts from inside North Korea describe people using money to move home. The new Yongsong district is far from the center of the town in Pyongyang. North Korean state media has not reported about public transport connections to the new development. For all the latest news, download the Weon app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.